cable car friend. Hello again. And how are we feeling? Hmm? I felt that we made some good progress. Agree. In the last session. But I'm grown concerned about your situation. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. That's the American flag. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Okie dokie. Women worry me, men worry me. Uh... Uh, 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 both? How do I do both? This is a little loaded for twenty twenty four. Uh, hey, uh, close your eyes, chat. Okay, you can open them. Planes scare me? Crowds scare me. Planes scare me more than crowds. Huh. Heights. Uh, whoa. Um, depends on the snakes. Some snakes are nice, and some rats are nice too. Some snakes are mean, some rats are filled with diseases and are dirty. I think rats because we used to have like mice in the walls and I could hear them scratching when I was sleeping at night. When I was a little kid. Knives or guns? Depends. Guns can be scary. Knives can be scary. Both are kind of scary. Knives are a little more scary. Good. Clowns are scary. Gore is scary. Did I startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. That's not necessarily true. No cockroaches. Okie dokie. Uh, oh, gore probably over needles. I don't like needles. Uh, very much clowns. Is this trying to tailor make the game to be scary? I hate gore. Oh, very much hate gore. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. it's not even a question. This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so diligent. Should I have lied? Cockroaches, clowns, an awful. The sun combination sounds like a good Friday night. I like this. Wait. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Well, I'm afraid. Once again, we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. 
You guys told me it's not scary. It's not? Bro, they went through most of my big fears. Heights, clowns, uh, cockroaches, gore. 9-11? gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh yeah? It feels the same to me. Persistent, creative, and playful. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, and I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey, guys. Get up here okay? Yeah. Well, more or less, but it was so good to see you. I did play to try to become What's human. Up no one liked my outcomes. Yo, yo, yo. We need to get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. Hey. Charitable. You're doing all right. I mean, I know it must be really tough without your sis. Stop. I just meant that. No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it, and I just I want us to have a good time, you know? Like we always used to. Damn it. This freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's got to be, like, a window around the corner we can get, like, get open or something. Wait a second. Are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey. Valid. Not if I don't report you. Oh, um, lead the way, coaches. What? Reported. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. So. Oh, romantic. I didn't even mind right, to be romantic. Doing? Good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah. That does sound pretty nice. Is Ashley nice? Okie dokie. What's up, buddy? Matt! Been a while. Rough season, huh? Yeah. Something like that. Mm. Hey, you okay, man? Very charitable. Some people, you know? You think you know him? Okay. Uh, can we keep talking? Are you okay? Is that a... Hello? I gave me an option, but now there's no... <laughs> I'm just walking around. <laughs> just, just hanging around. It gave me another pop-up, but now there's no pop-up. For a second, it was there. Hello. So, see Nash yet? Um, yeah. Cool. Cool, cool. How's, uh, how's she doing? She's fine. Why? No reason. Okie dokie. Uh, later, guys. Thanks for letting me walk over there and talk to those people. Just standing there waiting for Ashley me. Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? Who? She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? And I just want to rip that parka right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Uh, I don't remember. Absolutely. When are you gonna take her to the bone zone? Like, that could ever happen. Come on, man. She practically spends her entire life with you as it is. Well, yeah, but we're like friends. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect yeah, life like a scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley, alone at last. Like you, you said. Laid all the groundwork. 
You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Pat, thank you so much for the two. All right, sure. Maybe you're right. Now what am I? Romantic. You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. Jeez. If she is consenting. So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Koshis, or else you got four lovely ladies who are going to be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, uh, shoot. No actually, it on. is a good way to get laid. Technically, if you're going to uh, be out in the cold and you're about to die from cold... Mm. Then you need to axe holder. Huh. Why is there a missing axe? You need to get naked. Okie dokie. I'm gonna go over here. Damn, I'm getting pretty low in juice here. I just had to turn off my GPS. I'm finally. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. Yeah, then you gotta get close to the other person. Then, you know, what if you get a VZ or something? No, wait! Stay okay. down there! Should have paid more attention in climbing class. Bro got to go to gym? climbing class. Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa. Did I do that? Yeah. I, I don't think so. Here, use this. Oh, yeah, this is going to be helpful. Thanks. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? There's not a gas leak. Totally. What, what is it? Okay, so... I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant going to help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I got gotcha. you. Flamethrower. Just like we do That's a terrible dudes. idea. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye-bye, frozen lock. Bingo. Oh, right, for so the lock. This. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. Okay, but have you guys considered maybe it's a good idea to uh, shut that window and move that thing back so you don't have a random person coming into your house through an easy open? Oh, hello. What are you? <gasps> Premonition. Totem. Uh oh. <coughs> okay. Hear me out. Maybe the flamethrower is a bad idea. It's a mask. Hello. Can I open the door? Hmm. Huh. That's cool. Clue. Huh. It. What the hell was that? Hello. 
will. Any murderers in here? Nope. Any murderers over here? Chris, very funny. Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be like getting the lock open or something? On it. Hmm. I don't really want to set everyone on fire by accidental means. Hello. Let's see if there's any kind of clues. TV. No power. Could we not just like turn the power back on and then have everyone go through the window? their power to the answering machine but not power to the house hello friend Butterfly. <gasps> Black butterfly. Remember? Who's trying to get in here? Hello? There's a screamy noise. Coming. They're freaking window. A while it becomes uh, less scary to get jump scared. Thoughts? When you're constantly just hearing jump scares, the jump scares lose their value. When you know, uh, probably a jump scare in the next, it hasn't had a jump scare in 30 seconds. Probably a jump scare soon. Couch was not okay. It just appeared out of nowhere. I didn't like that. Scary couch. Well, I'll still get jump scared. I'm just saying that the, the potency of the jump scare diminishes. Hello. Right. 
Hmm. I can't read it because it's too dark. Wait, here? Ah. Horror film. So the dad is a director of horror films. And the brother wants to bring everybody back who was involved in his sister's death for a porno party. Hmm. Sounds a little sussy bock out of me. But some of the people were not involved in, in it. And some of the people were good, too. Uh, sure. That scared me. What was that? Perfect. We're freezing our buns off out here. I have no back up. Woo. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. <laughs> a fuzzy. Oh, that freaked me out. <laughs> what was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby, don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Hey, yo, we gotta go shut that window. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I'd use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Bro, was that necessary? We'll do. Yeah, come on in. Take a load off. Have whatever you want. You just take whatever you want anyway, right? Whoa. Easy there, cowboy. Do I have to play as this loser? What the hell were you doing with him out on the trail? Romantic. What? I saw you and him. It's better to be confrontational when it happens. Before? We just ran into each other. No. Nah. So we hugged and I said hello. Is that against uh. the law? Mm. I don't like either of these. Do I have to pick one? All right, I'll just wait 20 years. to choose because I don't like either. I guess... I guess, whatever. Right. Yeah. Duh. Sorry, it's been kind of a long day. I overreacted. Nah, man. Don't worry about it. Cool. I think yeah. it's better to... Okay keep the peace and not be upsetty spaghetti instead of trying to f start a fight right at the beginning of everybody's experience. So it's not for... Oh my god, that is so gross. Are you trying to swallow his face whole? Um. I mean, seriously, can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness too loud? Sounds like someone's better she didn't make the cut. Yeah, it's 
all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. That's real deep calling Miss Homecoming a cow. Why do I have to choose these two options? I would just sit back and let them do it. If I provoke... Alright, whatever. It just it helps Emily, and I don't really like Emily right now. But I also hate Jess, so it's like, fuck it, who cares? Hey, hey you're making everyone... <laughs> ...comfortable, Jess. Jealous much? Emily too frigid for you too. Hey, that's that's uncalled. Look, whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0, bitch. On a roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. Are you serious? Do you think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Okay, now I'm gonna choose Jess, or Emily, fuck it. Emily, stop. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is out of hand. <laughs> Provoke it and then like call it. everyone. Yeah, em, why are you picking fights over your ex-boyfriend, huh? Valid! This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. If we can't get along for 10 minutes, and maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? True. Mike. Why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Mike right. deserves death. Wanna go do that? Any place without that whore. It, it's right up the trail. Okay. Glad that's over. Yeah. I like this guy with the sports jacket, so, I like the Josh, guy with the beanie, uh, and I like the girl who is sweet. Huh? My bag, the the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you are you listening? Oh my God, don't you remember next to the I only have two Italian bags. Shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. No, she was just on Rodeo Matt, and and didn't bag. care. Oh my God, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you? Seriously, think I'd forget my bag? Yes. Well, do you? I... Yes. Guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Maybe you should carry your own bag, bitch. Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. Then we can get warm. We can get very warm. Sex isn't okay. even worth this shit. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. Hell yeah. Sam is the best. Okay, uh, I'm probably gonna kill everyone by accident, but... Exiled. My bad. Exiled. <laughs> Works for me. I don't like, uh, most of these characters. How far is this cabin anyway? I like Sam, this Letterman, Jacket, and Hoodie. He's the coziest, most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes on. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right and Oh yeah, and the blondie. The blonde guy. Porn stars. You're gonna need these. Porn star? I paid to see you. Uh, Hell yes. yeah. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No. I think they gotta be like 18. But also, ugh. Is there a way for me to not have to play as this guy? Or that girl? Or the other girl? Ugh. I actually hate a lot of these characters. It's crazy because I hated a lot of characters in the other game. Hey, hot lips. Photo booth? All right, read my mind. <sighs> okay. Hey, 
<laughs> Good effort. Next time I get the camera, okay? Well, okay, but it's not easy holding the thing all like backwards and forwards at the same time. Okay, let's go. I've got <laughs> a little tomfoolery. Hold on, I want to look around. Okay, so we got uh, ooh, an axe right there. Okie dokie. Wait, can I look around up here? Up, up, up. She's kind of scary, isn't she? How often am I going to be allowed to be up here? <gasps> A thing! Okay. Search the premonition. This one's red! Danger. Whoop. Red. If I see deer, don't go toward him. Wait. Ah. Oh. Yellow, brown, red. Okay. Lol. Uh, okay. So, wait. Red was danger. Brown is a loss. Yellow is good. But you know what? I'm gonna say it. Guidance. But should I have hit the bird? Burr, it is freezing out here. Now that's something I can help you with. Hello, it said there was a bird, but I didn't want to hit it. Uh, I got a few things in mind. Private property, Washington Estate. You can say it because I already passed that part. I can't go back now. Emily's as dumb as she looks if she thinks she can cut in on what we got going on. Maybe if we're lucky, she'll try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. If I play him like how he probably is in real life, uh, I'd probably, like, he would probably say she was being a bitch. But how I would say it is that he needs, she needs to be a little less aggressive. But I would have never instigated the situation to begin with. The situation probably wouldn't have happened. But I only instigated because I thought it would be kind of funny. Alright, fuck it. I think you bring out the worst. Yeah, he's a fucking loser. Is that so? Epic jealousy. Suck it. I like checking the stats, boo. I like knowing how my actions create consequences. Beep. Okay. <gasps> Cabin TSD. Mike, wouldn't it be nice to fire up the Jenny and get moving? Oh, they're dead. All right. Let's see. Down. Okay. Down. Boom. Nice one, Mikey. Nice. Uh. Uh. Nice. Woo! You are a wizard. Hair wizard, Harry. Uh, I'm pushing. He doesn't scare me. He's my friend. I think he doesn't like them. But I don't think he's a murderer. Kazam! The gates shall open. Is there? Pretty good, right? Yeah. Totally. No, this is 
Awesome. Oh, yeah. I bring the hits. This girl would wear a thong. I'm assuming they're all 18 because there's sexual innuendo. In which case, I'm allowed to say this. You psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. This guy I'm looks like he's so like 30. Psyched right now. It's like a little adventure, a sexcapade. Wow. GPA, so after uni? Police tape. GPA is uh, in uh, all of ours for America. You'd think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, they're all seniors? Getting the creeps now. Oh, it's weird. <sighs> Respectful? I hope they are at peace. What do you remember? Uh, I mean, I'm sorry, but R.I.P. Bruh, that was my bad. Let's see how it changes. Romantic. They are. I'm sure, they're happy. We're all thinking about them. I wish I picked the other option. That's a nice way of thinking about it. They're 19, 18, and 20. Oh, thank God. It would have been weird otherwise. That did not scare me. Did you hear that? I heard something. Yeah. Damn. I don't think we can get up to the cabin with a path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, a.k.a. Wax Museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. You know this what? This is a danger zone. Fuck it. We're adventuring. Ah! Ah! Oh, thank God. Fuck. Oh. Hey, Jessica. Yep. Hey. Oh, man. I'm okay. Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. I didn't think I felt. Uh, <laughs> you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. Uh, yeah. Can you get out? I... Uh, I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. All right, Jess, there's a cart. I think if you can push it, you can get by. All right. Okay, let me just try. Lol. It's too heavy. Hey, so, babe, Ugh. you see the little gap down there? Between the cart and the wall? The tiny little gap? Yeah, maybe you can just, you know, like shimmy through it or something. <laughs> Climb over the I cart, I appreciate bro. your confidence in my physique, but I don't think the ladies are gonna fit. Oh, with the, right, okay. It's a cart. Gotcha. Just climb on top hey, of it. So... Why don't you either toss that light down or, you know, be a hero and jump down here to assist me? Why not just pull her up? Whatever. I'm going down. All right, don't move. I'm coming in. Better hurry up before some other hunky beefcake gets here. <sighs> hey, handsome. Want to help me move this cart thing? She's not helping her. When I imagined us grunting together, this is not what I pictured. <laughs> nice cave. Here's the thing about caves, though. Um... Man-made caves are very dangerous. Ah! Oh. Ah! I didn't mean to do that. Oh, holy crap! Oh my gosh, are you okay? Uh, yep. 
This way. Oh, Nelly. This place is giving me the willies. And not the good kind of willies. Can I offer you a little comfort and reassurance? <laughs> we'll save it for the cabin, Buster. Sends them to the dead cabin. Huh. She seems to want to go that way. It was two seconds before another jump scare. I, I don't think we could have gone three or else the game probably would have had a yeah, panic I'm attack. It's time to go. Uh, hold on one second, please. There was something over here. Oops. Cigar stud. Might be somebody else on the mountain chat. The Red Death. This place is like historical. Holy bat cave. See, there's gotta be Native American, right? I don't think the miners were getting their arts and crafts on, no. <laughs> no, no, it's like a shrine or something. A shrine to what? Well, it's got a dream catcher. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Can we make a... Can we make the target go on something? It looked like you could probably get the target on something, but every time I try, it doesn't work. Okay, bye. Oh, a clue. Hey. Hello, clue. Map shows the structural... Inspect. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Okay. <gasps> Jesus, this place is a real fixer rubber. The owners knew that it was dangerous. Has ADHD and can't hold the light like a normal human. Send a woman in the front just in case of death. Now I'm third person watching him. Why am I watching from such a distance? Oh, what's up here? Hey, this way. Ayo, hey, ayo. Hey, it won't let me go that way. Okay. So we got this way, cabin, what's over here? Nothing. Well, well. When Josh said cabin, I thought, like, Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Uh, I'll take a ride on Air Force One. <laughs> all right, all right. Save it for the stump speech, buddy. I don't like either of these characters. Thus, oh, their uh, sexuality is making dreams, me less turned on. Gonna look class, gonna look You all right? I 
just saw someone at the cabin. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Let me see. Uh, okie dokie. Cabin is located at. Sampling the old eggnog again, babe? It's just us up here. I. Uh, maybe. Did I have a schizo attack? What was that? What? How did it jump in front of my face like that? Yeah, he literally... He literally saw something though. Oh, look! Wolf? Deer? Oak! Okay, hide from the oak. Carnivore? Caribou? Ah! Alberta? Blackwood Pines? You're allowed to hunt them. Grizzly bears are omnivores. They like the smell of food. Me too. Salmon? Bass? Shirts. Ah, near rivers, mountains. Dangerous. Roamed the land for thousands of years. Docile. Dominant male bulls. Aggressive. Okay. <laughs> Aggressive men. Not in my 2024. Ladies first. Okay. Sends them off into fucking psycho cabin all by themselves in the fucking. <gasps> wait, 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 wait. Not that way, not that way, not that way. Watch out, bird brain. I was just flirting, I guess, because. Just. Wait, am I romantic? Oh, funny. Just answering his mating call. Wow, you're easy. Yeah, you got a lot of love to give. <laughs> no, not that way! I'm gonna check the stats. Get over it, okay? I'm a stat checker. I'm an MMO player. You think I'm not gonna check the stats on everything? I'm checking them stats. What if I find all the clues? Wait, what's over there? There's a cabin. Don't go in that water, by the way. Is there two cabins? What's on the right side? Bro, there's bears, wolves, and uh, this, they're just sending these teens out in the middle of the night. Or twenties. Damn it, Josh! Then you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here. Really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. Jump it. Oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike, you've got something on your face. Oh, 
Bears are asleep in the winter. Okay. okay. Oh yeah. That's how it's gonna be. Just wolves. Yes. Yes. It's okay. She doesn't die yet. I know she doesn't die yet because she dies from the fall. Maybe. She was the blonde one, right? Hey! What? You wanna help me get this fire going? Uh, yeah. Well, it's not I'm like you have hot water. Into the bath. Oh. Oh, well, do you need any help with that? There's no Burn way they have hot water if they have no electricity. It's okay, the murderer is with the other Come people on. right now. Alright, Josh, let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. Maybe they want to murder Sam because she stayed behind and didn't run with the sister into the middle of. I'm assuming that the parents are devastated, so they are horror. They're horror movie that? makers. Thus, they're gonna give these people a horrible time before murdering them. That's my, my secondary. They're gonna try and blame it on the guy that they thought killed their daughter. Even though they didn't. He didn't. He was trying to save him. Yellow totem. Okay, good. We like yellow. Checking the cracks. Fuck. <gasps> wait. Fuck. <gasps> wait, wait, wait. Huh. Interesting. So I should go down there. Now I get it about the blondes thing, chat. How you guys can't see us? The difference between uh, Felix and I? I can't tell the difference between those two characters one bit. All blondes do, or they are the same person. Clue. Hannah and Josh and Beth, you are invited to Sam's Halloween party. October 31st, 2013. Fancy dress obligatory. Okay. Ha ha! Wait, I don't get it. Canadia Maple? Tattoo? Johan D. Smith or oh. Johan. <laughs> okay. Can I look at the bag? <gasps> Butterfly. Red butterflies mean danger. Hannah stuff. White butterflies mean good. Much. <gasps> mm. Hello, good to 
this be any more about Mike? Huh. Mosey's, uh-oh. This is not going to work. He's a crazy, reckless hunk of a man, and you're staying at home. Wait. Mostly sees. Uh-oh, this is not going to work. He's like a crazy hunk of a man, and you're staying at home, working on your embroidery, practice your G minor and the piano. Give up on it, or do something really wild. Run away from home, or get a tattoo or something. Anything to attract his precious attention. I mean, it's for love, right? Just do it. I see. Interesting. So she got the tattoo to try and get his attention, and when it got his attention, she thought, Oh, just like the thing said. And then it turned out to be a trap, even though it was just a harmless crush before. Then the advice given by the advice column thing said that, that she should try and be reckless to get his attention because he's reckless. Huh. I can't see. Uh, I did mention that I have visual snow, and this has uh, got visual snow added on top of it. Yes. So a little hard to see. Anything going on over here? It's not so bad on uh, uh on electronics by the way though because like i barely get visual snow uh when i'm in vr which makes me like vr a lot hello looking for friends what's going on over here Don't care, shut up, Ashley, you're a hoe. Oh, okay. This sounds like somebody is running around when the barefoot. Wait! Oh, that's the moonlight. There's a kitchen. So, oh, 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 Goblino. <sighs> All right, peanut gallery. You know what? I got an idea for you, girl. What? He called them the peanut gallery like they called them the peanut gallery. I hear soft rustling. You hear that? Is it me walking? Okay, through here. Fuck it. Locked. Huh. That room is locked earlier, too. Very interesting. Hmm. This crazy place we used to have a spirit board. Oh, what? Wow, you have a spirit board? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Those things are a joke, man. We do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time. Me and. Well. Hey, Josh, no hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Well, yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um, okay. Guess so. Brad, I mean, you're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? 
Okay, sure. But I'm gonna look for clues first. TV on? Nope. He's gonna wait for me anyway, right? Break it. Looking around your house. Boop, 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 boop. Hey, what happens if I click this while he's in the room? No new messages. <gasps> Delete it. Always locked. Why are there so many locked doors in this house? Clue already found? <laughs> you love for a ride along? A girl spends every waking moment looking at everything available at the house? Door locked? Interesting. This is the worst porn star party I've ever seen. I must say it. And I mean it. Hello. Thanks for waiting as I gently walk down the stairs. Hey. You notice how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together? Oh. Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. <laughs> they are very sweet together. Yeah. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. For I swear, real. they just need, like, something to bond over. You know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric <laughs> ward before Chris makes a move. Huh? Uh, brother might be losing his mind. Let's check this one. I have a feeling he likes this girl, though, Sam. The only girl who actually cared about his sisters. Twins, both dead. Tragedy. Couldn't have been helped. so far. The summer before they disappeared. Okay. You killed them? Yeah, that was my bad. Honestly, I don't know why when I saw Let Go, I genuinely thought it was going to be that she would let go and the guy would grab her. Um, but you know, I wanted to save them both. They both couldn't be saved. It was a whoopsie daisy on my end. Oops. You know, Sam. Yes, Josh. I just wanted to say. <sighs> what? No, I don't think Sam is really dating means anyone a lot right to now. Me that everyone came back this year, and you know that you came, Sam. We're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all going to make it through this. Together. Um, I want us to have a good time, you know? As he goes into the creepy, uh, basement room, poggers. Wait, there's a clue. Wait, turn around. Turn around. Creepy door. What's this? Is this a creepy door I can open? All the doors in this place are locked. 
What's over here? Wait. Uh, another creepy door? Wait, 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 I thought I saw something over this direction, no? Oh, uh, sorry, 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 I'm here, I'm coming! I'm just very, uh, interested in how many locked doors you have inside of your house. And I guess if you're gonna invite a bunch of teenagers over to your place. I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. Okay. She said as she uh, falls off her bike, bike and gets a bunch of big squat. Yeah, I can handle it. Don't worry about it. I can go fast too. Hmm. Horse? Sorry to drag you down into the bow. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own. True. You know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. Valid, true, real. Uh, X? R? Pretty rough playing baseball out in all that snow. No, it wasn't in the winter, silly. I mean, we'd come up in the summer and we would have the best time. The whole family was there. Mom, Dad, my sisters. It was some serious competition out there on the big lawn. I don't know. Can't go back. New reality, right, Sam? Anyway. I'm supposed to be fixing this whole guy, right? True, sorry. Didn't mean to give you post-traumatic stress disorder remembrances. Here, can you can you hold this? Yeah. What was that? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. Okie dokie. First things first, we gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mm, sounds kinda complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. How? Ah, oh, damn. It's okay. I'm just try again. What am I doing? You didn't give me instruction. Not that hard. Just press the button when the light comes on. Oh, okay, thank okay, you. Okay, okay, I'll get it this time. My bad, I didn't know. Whoa! That's more like it. All right. <laughs> I had no idea what was going on. Oops. I look away for two seconds! Wait, romantic? Funny, but not charitable. Uh-oh. Oh my god. Don't move. What? Something behind you. Yeah, right. <laughs> I gotcha. You were 
gonna look. I was not. What do you do? Honey, you're gonna have to do a whole lot better than that to freak Honey. me out, alright? Wait. Oh. Wait, okay, so you hear that too, right? Get the bats! Josh. What? Did I say just like weirdly regular? No, not nothing regular about it. Uh let's check it out together. Oh man. I just want to should... check it out. Why? What if it's like a a pipe that's about to burst or some problem with the furnace? Unlikely. Oh, it oh, grabs his arm. I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah. I wanna know how it's going. Hello? Can I move, please? Which one's move? This one's moved. Why is it so slow? Light bulb? <laughs> nice, nice one. That was good. Wait, but why would you do that? There's all this cool old movie crap down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor to it. Joke master. Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared, admit it. I was not. Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh. Leaves a woman to go scare what other God's people. What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Mm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. All right? So have fun. Where oh, is the electricity? Am I the only one who would be very, very, very much saying electricity would be highly important? Matt, you gonna come with me to get my bag? Yeah. Yeah, I'm coming. Uh, I had too much fun being nice and having fun, nice friend. Now I have to be back with fucking psycho bitch. We forgot my bag. I forgot my bag. Maybe while you were Why off Why, fucking you, with the other guy? Maybe you should have grabbed your stupid bag. And you tried to throw Sam into it. Hey, Sam? Yeah? Uh... <laughs> Maybe you should chill. Alright, I gotta do what I would really do. I think we should start the... It's Get the over. reality. Right now. Clean slate. Oh. No arguing. No mic. No Jess. Just. What do you want to be trapped up here on a fucking mountain with a bitchy woman chat? Nature. Just try. You try your best to get through it, then break up with her after. Damn straight. Just, just make it through it until, until. You don't have to anymore. Hang out with the more fun people. Uh, hello. I would like to click this. Okay, we got swing. There's a flashlight by the swing. And a totem. Uh, 
Let me guess. Woo! Alright. Let's go to the swing flashlight. That's because the other characters turned the generator on. Don't be afraid. Wait, what's over here? Is this it? No. Bro, I am hungry. Hey, doofus, come this way. Good idea to leave this path here. Don't be a puss. Come on, it'll be worth it. You'll see. No thanks. I'm gonna do my own thing. Why don't you come with me over here and I could uh, swing you? Oh, okay. I guess just no flashlight then. Ugh. Butterfly pink and blue with black thing? Hannah. Hannah's the sister, right? Weird. How come I can't pick up that flashlight? What are you doing, weirdo? What? I came back. Good boy. Now obey. See ya. You think it will actually let me leave? Cause I'ma let her, I'ma let her die. God, I hope she just does not have to. Choices matter, fuck yes. Get me away from this bitch. Literally get me away. Oh, okay. So I guess I'm just forced into being right now. Do any of you like this woman, or...? I'd be real, I do not like her. I'm a Sam stan. And I am not a her stan. Can I go, like, sit on the swing or something else? Like, I don't want to be anywhere near this shit. I hate- I hate this one. Just a creepy- I feel like there's something missing with this, because usually if I pick something up, I get, like, a... I get- What's this? Why does this poor- he didn't even do anything. You know what? And he's nice and cool. Why does he have to be with her? It's like unfortunate for him. I guess sometimes- yeah. what? Yeah? Thanks for helping me find my bag. I know I can be a little high maintenance. Uh, you're cool. It's no problem. But you gotta remember, there's more to this guy than just being a lean, mean, luggage-lifting machine. Gonna back that up? All day. 
What? All day. <laughs> nah. Wait, what does that mean? Like, Making the all best. Day long. I was Adam. being like sexy. You were being silly. I don't know if I can even consider that sexy. I don't know, when you're young and dumb, your your dialogue choices are kind of stupid. Cool. Are we gonna have to go all the way down the mountain? So pretty out here tonight. Wow. Yeah. It's so nice to be here with you, muscle man. Uh, I'm not all muscle. There are some brains in here too. Well, you got enough brains to like me, so let's see that brawn. Yeah, we're hey, he is kind of stupid. Outside of what? My car. I like your car. Roomy. This ain't roomy enough for you? No. Uh, you know what? Maybe there's a better spot. Does this spot start with a G? <laughs> there Jeez. are lots of places out here. <laughs> Started clearing this off for us. <laughs> You're like, nah, I was sure. cool back then. Come on, let's look around. Oh, I want to know what's on this spot. Oh, well, look at that. Hey, what the hell, Em? Don't be jealous. Why would you take me here? You made me feel like a chump. Don't be so sensitive. I'm here with you right now. Mike's the chump. Okay, maybe chump isn't the right word. What is? Lucky. <sighs> mm. What are you got in there? Bro, I'm so glad I cleaned off that table. She takes me to the spot where she was romantic with another guy? That's not good. What's so important in the bag, anyways? It's just my undies. The lacy ones. Well, hell, we don't need those. True. You want me to model them for you? I'm just gonna rip them off anyways. Maybe I want to show them off. Puts me in a generous mood. Let's go get them. All right. This man's gooning. This woman's gooning. This is a goon, goon, goony, gooner. Let's go up here. Wait, is it up or which way? I'm going up. I see a big totem. Very curious to learn about the historical totem. The sexy kisser on this thing dared put your hand in it. No. Day, I wouldn't. Just slide it up in. Don't do that. Okay, I investigate. Emily! Emily! <laughs> gotcha, big dip. Jesus, you're ridiculous. Oh, come on. What's that? Uh, I'm not sure. Probably just He's an animal. Do you not like. Anything else around here? I feel like you shouldn't be putting your arm through that. What is the historical significance of the mouth open on the, to on the totem? Does anyone know? Don't worry, it's not that scary. The jump scares are scary at the beginning, but they're after a while there's like 400 of them and they just lose their potency. You are, madam. Thank you. Oh my, very impressive. Gloriel. Just like the other game we were playing. With the box. <sighs> Means it's going? <laughs> oh my. Everything is locked.
The scream was probably from them upstairs when she gets scared in the basement. Nope. I don't like that. <gasps> I'm a restored person! She might have made a snowman. Uh, that was not there before. It played me! Welcome back. Oh. Uh. Huh? It's gotta be Chris. Or Josh. They're just trying to mess with us. Kind of uncool, guys. I don't like this. Me neither. Oh! Dad! What the hell's going on? What the hell did this? You know, I'm kind of not giving a shit about my panties anymore. I kind of just want to split. Agreed. Now I know not to tell the truth in these meetings. Oh, very cool, bro. Hey guys, I'm having a question. Is this psychologist, uh, does he have valid credentials? I would like to understand your feeling toward people who fear failure and worry about what others think of them. I don't feel that he does. Do you share this fear? No. No. Then how do you feel about people who are afraid? I'm indifferent. Everybody gets afraid of something at some point. I feel sympathy. I see. Well, Chris has a fear of failure. Do you feel pity for him? Who's Chris? Yeah, all right. Well, this is not reflected in the way you are playing your game now, is it? Mm -hmm. Who's Chris? Now, Blonde. let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Okie dokie. Which would you say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? Hold on one second as I think. Each situation has different outcomes that have different probabilities. Listen, you could be honest, and when you're honest, it's good, but honesty can have its faults. Maybe if I'm sick, I don't need you to tell me I look horrible. You could tell me you're looking a little better. Loyalty can have its values. It's great to be loyal. Hold on, where's the faults in the whales? But if you're loyal to my faults, then I never progress as a person. And then I have issues being the best person that I could be. And that's not good. So both to me have equal value and equal issue. I can understand a reason to be dishonest. There are plenty of reasons to be dishonest. If you maybe are dealing with something and you don't really feel the need to talk about it, and well, no, because then you could just honestly say that you you don't want to talk about it. And then being need to be disloyal. I don't know, what defines loyalty? Okay, what defines loyal? Why can't definitions just give me a better answer? Giving or showing firm and constant support or allegiance to a person or institution. Interesting. Uh... 
Mm, I think support is better. Yeah. I think I think I would go with support over over honesty. There are reasons I can understand to be dishonest if I have a birthday coming up and you're going to throw me a surprise party. Maybe if if that happened, it could be okay. Let me think about it. I like lear learning about myself. Lie in order to be loyal to a friend, okay. And what about loyalty versus charity? Hmm. To give to others or to be loyal to a person? Well, they're two different things. Uh, I think the chari charity is very important. Do I consider it more important than loyalty? No. I think loyalty is probably more important than charity. Charity is something that you give later if when all the other needs are needs are met. If like I was thinking of a hierarchy, charity would be like at the top of the hierarchy. So you would sooner look after your friends before caring for those in greater need? It depends, yeah. Oh, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. He doesn't know you, little bro. 